What's going on everyone? Hope you're having a good day. Just finished a run. Please excuse the appearance. But anyway, so name of the video is the Tundra is going in for service prematurely. So it's going in about a month early. I usually send it up uh, the end of May and the end of November for its Toyota care and everything. But the reason we're sending it up a little bit early is the other day I happened to have my right window down, my passenger window down, and Entune was doing the insufficient connectivity, so for once, thank you Entune. And uh, I started to hear a little bit of a consistent whistle, we'll call it. And it's kind of like when you drove by certain things that were close to you, you heard the sound bouncing off of it. And the first thing I thought of when I heard it was, damn, I need new brake pads because that was the same sound that I was hearing in my 09 when I needed new front brake pads. Now the truck only has 10,000 miles on it, we know that. Uh, but just don't forget it has a heavier tire on it. Um, this truck's life is stop and go traffic all the time. So I'm not surprised that I'm starting to get that whistle. I don't know for sure if it is the brake pads, um, if it needs new brake pads, but this is the same kind of sound that was coming from my 09 and that ended up needing new brake pads. So basically anytime the wheel is in motion, you hear a little bit of a whistle. And right now it's not as bad as my 09 was because I'm guessing I caught it uh, pretty early. But yeah, so then I started to drive around with my right side, passenger side window down and just listen to see if I could hear it now. You know, I hear it all the time. Doesn't matter what speed. So what I'm gonna do real quick is I'm gonna put my camera outside the truck. I'm gonna suction cup it to the window so hopefully you can hear the sound. Now, it would be a lot better if I could suction cup it down by the actual tire. You'll probably just hear a lot of wind. I don't know how good the video will be. But the problem is if you've been around the channel for a long time, uh, the last time I suction cupped it to the body of the truck, the camera fell off and another car ran it over. And uh, high five to GoPro because you're actually watching this video on that same camera still. But the mount and the suction cup and everything was destroyed. So go back through my videos and find that one. I think that was August 2016. That was an early one. But uh, yeah, so we're going to suction cup it to the window and I'll see if I can give you a little bit of sound. So let's check it out. So hopefully that sound was okay. I don't know. I'll see it when I get home. But so that's what's going to happen. It's going to go up next week. I already scheduled it. Liberty Toyota. So we're going to do the Toyota care. Um, we're going to do the whatever's wrong with the squeak. I told them to just check the squeak. It might be something completely different, but you know, that's what I'm thinking it is. And last but not least, a major, major, major detail inside and out of this truck. Um, the inside, I haven't washed this truck in like, I don't know, two months, maybe August. It was definitely summer, uh, but the interior hasn't been done in a long time. And although I keep it very neat and very nice, I do run six miles a day. As you see right now, I'm sweating. So the interior could use a nice uh, brush up. You know, let's get some leather conditioner down on the seats, some fresh scent lemon or whatever in here, and we'll just do that. So those are the three main things I'm doing uh, when it goes up. Other than that, obviously between from the last Toyota Care to this Toyota Care, uh, the truck is in great condition. Nothing's wrong with it or anything, um, you know. But these brake pads are probably going to need to be changed. But I will keep you updated on that, of course. So that is what's going on, and that is why it's going up a month early. So if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please below the video, of course. Twitter and Instagram at Dude 34 It is Friday night. I hope you guys have a good, uh, good time tonight. Be safe out there. I gotta work, so have fun for me. Take care.